Sophia here from Leapfrog Fight TV and today I'm at Liverpool at the Almighty Fighting Championships joined by your winner Kieran Briggs who has just scored a knockout in round one. How are you feeling mate? <laughs> just, yeah, feel good. Just another day at the office really, isn't it? Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, I've got nothing to say really. <laughs> I mean, there's not really much to say. No, it was, it was <laughs> over quick, so... Yeah, he came out and I was surprised because he's apparently a wrestler on the GB team, so I expected him to come out wrestling. And he seems to have improved his striking a lot since his last fights, uh, which surprised me. But So with yeah. that in your head, what was sort of the game plan going into the fight? I don't really go into fights with game plans. I just go in and uh, just, just concentrate on myself. Um, yeah. Concentrate on what you want to do. Concentrate on what I want to do, yeah. So talk to me about um, your training for this fight. Because obviously you got it done and dusted. Yeah. I'm assuming that was the plan. Yeah, well, I had a fight a couple of weeks ago. And um, I have got boxing experience, amateur boxing experience. <coughs> but uh, I've sort of let that fall by the wayside. So after my last fight, I started training again with uh, Carlisle Villa Boxing Club to sort of improve my boxing game. And obviously, uh, I train with the Radiolas. That's a team I fight out of. They're the, they're probably the best. Well, they are the best Jiu Jitsu team in Cumbria, and they're one of the best Scotland teams in the in the country. So, I've so got a decent pedigree. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, if you're surrounded by those sort of people, your level's just going to go up. Yeah, right? yeah, definitely. Um, like I say, these are the best team in the country. So I can't get any better, really. Um, and yeah, I've been getting some good sparring in a Carlisle Villa, and they're one of the best boxing teams in the country so yeah well absolutely so you've got a couple of fights done this year yep. what's next what's your plans uh i think i'm supposed to be fighting in two weeks i oh, need wow. to speak to my coach <laughs> got them lined so, up and ready yeah well i'm 27 now when i've been doing this for a long time um but with, with injuries and covid and stuff uh, there's been a few years that i've sort of fell by the wayside so i'm just gonna make up for lost time yeah just making up for it now yeah. so what are you going to do to celebrate tonight then <laughs> Well, if I'm fighting in two weeks, I can't be celebrating yeah. too hard, so I'll probably just be driving back home to West Cumbria, uh, Getting on with it. which will be about three and a half hours drive, going to sleep and back at training next week. Yeah, well, good for you, mate. Um, just before we go, is there anybody you'd like to shout out? Shout out as in opponents? No, I, I mean, say. you can if no, you want. No, no, yes. <laughs> uh, no, I'll just thank you to my team, my cornermen, uh, the Radiolas, uh, Carlisle Villa Boxing Club, also Working work Community Boxing Club. All my friends and family and supporters, uh, it's only going to go out from here. Brilliant. Well, thanks very much for speaking with me and all the best for this year. Thank you. No worries.